Hello guys! Welcome back sa ating channel. And for today's cooking vlog, magluluto po tayo ng beef broccoli with potatoes. Para po sa mga ingredients at paraan ng pagluluto, just keep on watching. Ang mga ingredients po ay beef cut into strips, we have onions sliced, cornstarch, garlic chopped, potatoes cut into cubes, pepper, oyster sauce, chili flakes, salt, at syempre ang ating broccoli, and mga kailangan din po tayo ng water and cooking oil sa pagluluto. Tara na po. Let's start cooking. First, let's put cooking oil. Konti lang po. Just enough to saute our garlic and onion. Let's keep it warm for some time. At magsimula na po tayong mag -isa. Oil is already hot. So, simula na po natin by sauteing our garlic. After garlic, let's put in our onions. Alam nyo na guys, pag nagigisa ako ng onion, I see to it na I put a little pinch of salt para mas madaling maging translucent ang ating onion, just like this. Now that the onion and garlic are ready, let's put in our beef, cut into strips, and let's continue sauteing until the beef become cooked and tender. At this point, our beef is cooked and tender. Now we can add in our potatoes. Let's simmer it for some time until our potatoes are partially cooked. When potatoes are partially cooked, we can now add in our pepper. salt chili flakes and also our oyster sauce Let's give it a stir until all the added ingredients are properly incorporated. Just keep on stirring. After mixing all the added ingredients, now we can put in our broccoli. Thank you. 
After mixing, just add a little water and simmer it for at least 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, this is now our beef broccoli with potatoes. I will just give it a quick stir just to make sure that it is evenly cooked. And guys, I found a beef broth cubes in my pantry so I will add one cube. Otherwise, if you don't have this one at home, you can skip this step. Guys, I'm adding a little bit of sugar in our beef broccoli just to make the taste balance. Otherwise, if you don't want this sweet tasting your food, you can skip this step. Let's simmer it again for another 2 minutes, so all the flavors will be absorbed by the beef and vegetables. After 2 minutes, we will add our slurry. Slurry is a mixture of cornstarch dissolved in water. This will help to make our sauce thick. After adding the slurry and after the sauce become thick, our beef broccoli with potato is ready. Now we can turn off the heat and ready to serve. Here you go guys! This is our finished product, our beef broccoli with potatoes. I hope you enjoyed that we made a little bit of twist in this commonly served food by adding potatoes. I guarantee you that this will be very delicious and very healthy. Surely your family will enjoy it. So please don't forget to give a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you will be updated for my next one. Thank you for watching guys. See you. Happy eating. Thank you.